It's looking like rain. Yeah, it really is. All right, hopefully uh, the 10 minutes or so that we're doing this video will be okay. <laughs> yep. All right, a $750 CRKT. It just doesn't seem right. No, it really doesn't. Mm -mm. A couple of months ago, I would have said it will never happen. Yeah, or should it happen? Right. I think, Frankie, I think it's part of the shock factor. Yeah, true. Get it? <laughs> right. I get it. <laughs> you get it. Okay. So, what's the deal with this knife anyway? They made 200 of them. Yes. It's the shock. I probably know a little bit more about it than you do. I know nothing about it. You know, you've seen pictures. Uh, well, I, okay, I've seen pictures and I know something special about it. Seven hundred fifty dollars. I know it's price. Okay, yeah. All right. In that case, then I barely know any more than you do, <laughs> and I've not handled one. Yeah. Okay. I've got one here. All right. You guys have to trust us on this, by the way. Yeah. This is for a separate video. We've opened this knife. The but CRKT we haven't opened that one. shock is inside there. All right. Neither one of us have handled it. We have it on loan, too. Yeah. We have to say that we have it on loan. We do have this knife graciously on loan. One of the 200 buyers was Mr. Jimmy Slash. Yes, it was. Okay, excellent channel. Um, do us a favor and give him a subscription of yours. Yeah. So, uh, and yeah, I'm he's, glad that he's he very bought popular. this because I don't think I'd pay $750 for a CRKT. Watching I'm some of, saying. Watching some of his videos, though, this is his style of knife. Yeah, it is. Seven hundred and fifty. I don't know. That's probably one of his more expensive knives. True. But, yeah. Um, this is his style of knife for sure. Let's get into it okay. uh, first. All right. Does it come with Before the, you open the it. leather? This pouch. I think so. Really? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it's missing the box. <laughs> he asked me. Um, we could just you know save on shipping and just, yeah. I think the box would have had to be like three oh, times yeah, bigger. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay, it's heavy. Is it made out of gold? Um. Thinking no. Can I unwrap him? Go ahead. Like a little baby. Wait, Frankie. What? Build the suspense. <laughs> <laughs> okay. No, okay. Is that it? Oh, there it is. I've definitely seen this. Did knife. you see it? I've seen it a lot in video. Whoa. Okay. <laughs> there it is. Yeah, let's see. It is. Custom oh, look. CRKT this doesn't even fold leather back. pouch. Yeah, that is. Uh, at slot for it. Okay. <laughs> Frankie laughs at slot. All right, you've okay. got it in your hands. It's huge. Oh, I love that clip. It is really, it, I like the gold accent. Okay, this is a good looking knife. Either one of us are gonna flip it just yet. Why not? Because we're gonna take it in. Okay. There's the back side of the deadbolt lock. All right. That's what's special about it. It's, it's I think $750 special about for it. For this, yeah. yes. No, kind of. <laughs> the flipper tab? really kind of small. Yeah, it I, is. I know knives that are a quarter this size with a bigger flipper tab. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta say, I really like the carbon fiber and gold. It's, Manufacturers should do that more often. It's a good color combo. It's really excellent looking. How about the back side? Ooh, okay. Ooh, yes. gold backspacers too. Standoffs, yep. Yeah. All right, a pivot collar around the deadbolt mechanism. Yes. Let's talk about that briefly. Okay. Um, still not flipping it. <laughs> <laughs> the deadbolt. My take on it is it's kind of a it's kind of an overbuilt button lock. Yeah. All right. Um, we'll see how much that uh, um, yeah applies here. But yeah, what I thought it was is that it will lock into place for a fixed blade too. But I could be wrong. I handled one at Shot Show, so I'm not sure. Not one of these though. No, not one of these. What was that other one? The seismic. You handled the seismic yeah. and I did not. I, I can't remember handling I was fondling the deadbolt lock because I wanted to see what it was like. <laughs> gotcha. Okay. But, yep. All right. Yeah. Um, that's the only other, as of the time of this video, that's the only other deadbolt knife out there yeah. is the seismic. All right. You want the first flip? I don't With know. I always feel bad. Wee I... little hands. Okay. Whoa. Nice sound. It is big. <laughs> it's kind of huge. It's uh, quite large. We don't really have the specs on it here. All right, you see it's clean. There's no, I went for like a liner or a frame lock there, you know. Yeah, so it locks into place more so. Oh, look at that. You see what I mean? Like it pretty much is almost like a fixed blade, but I mean, it's not, but you would have to push the button to deactivate it. Yeah, they do an exploded view. CRKT's got an exploded they explode view. They it? Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, speaking of that though, a lot of people uh, um, are keeping these, you know, as a safe queen, but. Oh, look, it's number 175 out of 200. Oh, he got one of the later ones. Yeah. 
Nice job, Jimmy Slash. Okay. Well, let me, let's do the, you got the first flip, I get okay. the first. Retraction. Whoa, nice. It's a kind of a guillotine. <laughs> <laughs> you, you pronounce the L's, that's funny. Guillotine, wait. What, what am I Whoa. supposed to, how am I supposed to pronounce it? Guillotine. Gu guillotine, no. <laughs> guillotine. Guillotine. <laughs> Okay, that's yeah, pretty that awesome. Stupid. Be careful with it, though. Okay. If you drop it, I'm going to edit this video. <laughs> Jimmy Slash will not know. No. The knife is tough. It'll take it. But like I say, people are buying these at $750 and only $200. How, much, how many of you out there are really beating on your CRKT Yeah, shock? how many of you guys are out there beating on it? Beating on it, yeah. Yes. Okay, please don't tell us. <laughs> no, but to put this into heavy use, which it's capable of yeah and that's what it's kind of marketed as um it's not going to happen with these no i don't know if it should i don't know oh, i'm that's, not sure the action is sweet i i don't know i just can't see why it's 750 dollars it's just me but i don't know it's made in taiwan did we mention yeah, that it is made in taiwan it's a flavio icoma Ecoma. yeah of the of the bearings which actually there is the icoma bearing icoma oh, course so it's that guy yeah ikbs okay yep same guy cts xhp so it's nothing i mean that's a premium Super steel special but steel? it's nothing crazy yeah right are they gonna make a production version of this knife? it would be interesting i'm gonna uh, buy isn't one is this a production version at 200 no but i mean like it, they I don't know. I'm just saying it seems like, what is it, like a mid-tech then? Yeah. Um, it's just a very low production run or yeah. probably a mid-tech. I'm sure there's a lot of time in each knife. So, yeah, I mean, they're not giving any away, uh, any video footage away <laughs> of the Taiwan factory that they're using. True, yeah. Of the production of these. It is an interesting lock. Yeah, take a look here as I actuate that. So it's double pins from what I remember on each side there yeah and it's supposed to be just crazy crazy strong like you could baton with this all day long is the idea hmm. <laughs> jimmy slash by the way is known to do that A baton but he's not done it with this knife no i wonder if he's going to <laughs> i don't think so i wouldn't <laughs> right i wouldn't i really like the color combo that the gold pivot collar with the carbon fiber yes looks really good it's a great looking knife it is really good yeah, looking. we didn't bring much to compare to you've got the jum bones there or okay yeah, yeah i do that? have the jum bones yeah because that's what we were talking about on the way over here is that like crkt we're kind of averaging out 65 75 dollars mm -hmm. this one's more expensive at like 95. this is a more expensive crkt right but look it's about the same size <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> That's crazy. And of course, there is the smaller version of this knife. So this knife is already huge. It's a little bit longer, the Jumbones is. Do you want me to make it look really big? <laughs> Go I for mean, it. What is your EDC That's what I said anyway? last night. Oh, jeez. What is your EDC? <laughs> <laughs> the UTX-70. Look at that. <laughs> I just want to mention, I just want to mention this real quick. I know for a fact you're not allowed to carry these at your job. I didn't carry it today. Okay. It was in the car the whole time. Sure. It yeah. was, I promise. Okay. Sure. Um, as long as we have it out. You brought a Delica? You brought my Delica? A Delica, you know. You could use those as a standard yeah. of measure, right? I'm true, Nobody yes. else has ever done that. No, nobody. There you go. But look at that thing. It's huge. Get the different angles here. Check that out. How uh, thick We brought the calipers, actually. Yeah, yeah. I was going to ask. I was like... There you go. Jeez. Yeah, set these aside. But just to give you an idea, the knife is huge. 0. 0.72? Okay. You should have brought a Medford to compare it to. Actually, yeah, true. That's what would be the closest. The, the next closest in size to this for a Medford would be the, um, the Marauder. Yeah. My Tanto Marauder. People were giving us a hard time for measuring in millimeters. Nobody's but a lot gonna... of people really like it, too. Okay, all right. 18.3. It's going to add time to every video. While you got them out, though, yes. the blade stock. Oh, okay. It's got to be thick. Yeah, it's, it's got to be. be. really thick, I'm guessing. 0.18. Um, yes, not too bad, though. Yeah. Not too bad. Not as bad as I thought it would be. Yeah. Jeez. It's, I really like it. If they do a production version of this, um, I think they should. If they do a production version of this CRKT, I will have to get one. 
Frankie, yeah, I'm not sure you're crazy about the knife. But I wouldn't mind it in a smaller version. Well, like if there was like a normal size version of it. The deadbolt lock. I would be okay with it. I like the color combo a lot. I really, really do. Make a mini version of this and yeah. it would be, you know. Normal. Yeah, I don't know what, what it would be like. It okay, would still look. be a big knife. How much do you think he weighs? Like oh, four that, or five pounds? That action is super clicky. What would you say? Four or five pounds, yeah. Uh -huh. um, let's see. Close to a pound. Oh my god. <laughs> it's 11.10 <laughs> ounces. That's really heavy. Do you want to do grams for the heck of yeah, it? Yeah, let's do it. Where are we at? What is that? Three, 314 grams. Oh, grams, oh my gosh. Okay. That is so heavy. Of course, you can open it with the slot there too. That action is excellent, but you really do kind of need big hands yeah. to, to appreciate it fully. I don't know, or yeah, maybe do. I'll ask you. I don't know, what do you think? It's a little awkward for my little hands. So there's a flimsy little liner lock, and that's where this thing is supposed to shine, really. But isn't it nice, though? Yeah, That mechanical it is. feel on this? It has a good ting to it, too. It does, it does. All right, guys, what are you thinking of the shock? Okay, pronounced shock, it's XOC. How do they get shock out of that? I don't know. Fox. Shock, I guess. Yeah, it works. <laughs> shock. <laughs> As I just pronounce it normally. Shock. Yeah. So it's got a little slight recurve. You could probably hit that on some flat stones. Falls off the cliff there. Satin finish on this blade. I don't know. For me, I can't understand the price. Um, I guess I understand it a little bit more, this being a, we'll call it like a proof of concept. Yeah. So the concept being the deadbolt, all right, and they just did it in a super expensive knife. Yeah. Super uh, kind of, I don't know. I, I don't mean, it's know. Taiwanese. It's not, it's not custom or it's not. True. I don't know. I don't know. True. I, like you can get a $750 easily custom. Well, and we definitely, part of the reason we want to do this video is we want to hear from you out there. Yeah. Who what else do you has think of these? this? Well, not very many of you. Well, only 199 other people out there. Okay. So, who else wants a production version or wants to see more of the same thing, maybe in different sizes? Yeah. That flipper tab could almost be bigger. <laughs> it well, works, and What I noticed, because my hands are so little, when I flip it out to deactivate the... I have to kind of keep my hand out <laughs> and brace it with yes the i do because i don't want it to get caught on my sleeve or anything jeez okay but it's a little i, I gotta, don't know i gotta try it just once no I, i'm pushing on the button huh is there something preventing it i don't know you can't do the like the button button deploy or whatever oh, you're not gonna do it if i can't do it you can't do it no, that's okay. I want to do it. We're not going to throw your knife. <laughs> well, if slash. we do, it's not going to be on camera. True. You would never, <laughs> you would never know. You he would gets, never like, know. Grass in it. <laughs> right. Yeah. Send it back. There's like grass and dirt hanging out of the. I don't know what you know, happened. <laughs> Felix. Damn. Damn post office. Okay. Uh, production version. Yes, please. Yeah. The I can seismic. See that. We'll put a link into what you can get now with this same mechanism. Okay. Much um, more affordable. Yeah. Um, definitely get those now, but even those, 120, 130, somewhere in there. Yeah. Expensive for a CRKT. Mm -hmm. Very cool. Yeah, you guys that own these, you're lucky. You're lucky. Yeah. Take a look at that clip. That's beautiful. It is really pretty. It really is. Yeah. Well done, guys. I mean, it's nice. It's yeah. nice for sure. Yeah. Oh, one last thing before we go. What's that? I guess the pivot or the, sorry, the, the detent is adjustable. Oh. I've not looked into it and we're probably oh, not going to do it. Oh, is it right here? Because I there? saw that in there. It's kind of a different. Is it? I don't know. Hmm. It was a different spot for a screw, so I thought maybe it was. Possibly so, yeah. It would adjust. Um, I'd have to look at the disassembly vid, but yeah. Cool. Yeah, I don't know. It was just a different screw spot. It's pretty good where it's at. Yeah. yeah. Interesting. <laughs> All right. Thanks a lot for joining us, guys. And um, like we say, let us know. Thanks, Jimmy Slash. Yeah, really. Yep. Uh, the rain stayed away. Yeah. Cool. Oh, and thanks for watching. Bye.